guys, it's Rose with Rose Likes Crochet. How is everybody doing? Uh, I am filming this video on Saturday, September 4th, but it's probably not gonna, you're not gonna see it until September 5th, which is Sunday. So I'm Rose, I like to crochet and I like yarn a lot. And I also make stitch markers. So go check out my Etsy shop. Um, I am here in the Chicagoland area. I have one daughter, her nickname is Carrots. And we have a bunch of animals, so we call this place the zoo. So this year, along with last year, you guys and this channel help support a domestic violence organization that is also based here in the Chicago area called Wings. Now, all of the information for Wings will be down below. And uh, since this is part two, I did go over in part one a lot of the um, uh, administrative stuff about Wings, as well as what they're asking for for each month. Uh, so for this month, which is September, they're asking for doll clothes and plus size aprons. And for October, they're looking for um, washcloths, um, dishcloths, scrubbies, face scrubbies, shower poofs, and kitchen towels, but not crocheted kitchen towels. They're looking for the towels that you can buy in the store, and then you crochet along the top of it and put a little hooky loopy thing on it. November, they're asking for toys for boys and chunky baskets. If you have any other questions, please see down below in the description box. There's tons of information down there and you can also email me. So today, which is part two, or this is part two of this huge box uh, extravaganza that I have, I am gonna show you 18 packages, but they're, some of them are really, really big. So um, part one, which was posted yesterday, had 22 packages so this is just absolutely incredible now what I'm showing you even though this is September update these are stragglers from August so please do not send in any more hats or scarves or winter wear um, we are now in September so they're only asking for doll clothes and um, plus size aprons for this month so if you have not sent out your winter wear please do not send any more winter wear here um, they are uh, overwhelmed with all the donations and so excited but now it's time for them to get set up for their winter wear drive so I do appreciate everyone who has sent in items in the past and who will send in items in the future Okay, so let's get started. The first box is from Cherie and she is from Virginia and she sent this card and she writes, uh, Rose, um, thank you so much for all your hard work for Wings and for inspiring us all to push ourselves. Thanks for the opportunity to give with a purpose. I went through a lot of my stash yarn. I'm loving my project bag. Thanks from Cherie. She says, I continued making hats after Hat Not Hate. Had a blast making them all. I pray every recipient gets a warm hug of love when they wear all the winter wear that has been donated. Yes. Okay, so she also sent a list of all of the yarn that she used for all of the hats and I'm not gonna go through this, but if anyone has any questions about the yarn that was used for any of these hats, let me know and I'll, I'll send you a picture of this list. Um, but I'm not gonna go through all this right now. So, oh my gosh, are you guys ready for the hats? The first thing she sent are these little kid hats and I'm gonna leave them in the bag so I can remember to put them in with the kids stuff. So it looks like there's two little hats in there. And then everything else is like a ton of hats. Are you guys ready? There's a lot. Okay, two. Oh my gosh, these are so pretty. Four, six, eight, 10, 12, 14, Oh my gosh, these are so pretty. 16, 18, 20, 22, 24, 26, 28, 30, 32. And then these were all tied together. So there is 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, and 39. So 39 hats plus the two little baby hats. And Cherie, I really appreciate you sending all of these beautiful hats. They're gorgeous. Remember, if anyone wants to know the yarn, just um, send me an email and I'll shoot you out that list that she sent. 
Okay, let's get to the next one. So the next box came all the way from Canada. Oh my gosh, I love you guys, you're so cool. And this is from Karina from Canada. And she wrote a note and she says, Hi Rose, I look forward to all your posts updating us on donations to Wings. I learned how to crochet doll clothes thanks to Norma's amazing tutorials at allmycrochet.com. I also included a few doll blanket and pillow sets. I hope Wings will also accept them. Thanks for your hard work for Wings. Enjoy the treat from Karina. Oh my gosh. Okay, so here are the treats and you are very brave to be sending these in August and September because we still have 100 degree days here. So I am definitely going to take a look at these and put them in the fridge, maybe make sure that they're not melted. Thank you so much for sending these. And then um, not only did she send uh, the doll clothes, but she also sent a bunch of these little tiny doll clothes hangers and they're so cute. Oh my gosh. Look at how tiny they are. There's a whole bunch of them, guys. I'm not going to show you all of them. So she sent a bunch of those. And then she had some that were in bags. So I'm going to leave these in the bags. This says doll blanket and pillow set. So there's that one. Oh, here is another one. Oh my gosh, these are so cute. They're so cute. Okay, and then this one says doll dress and poncho. Oh, shut the front door. Look at that. Oh my gosh, and there's a little flower on the dress. Oh my gosh, these are so cute. And this one says doll dress, poncho, and shoes. Okay, so there's the poncho, and there are the shoes. And then the little doll dress has a little flower on it. OMG, are you serious? You guys, just so you know, I will not be making any doll clothes for September. <laughs> I'm not good at the little things. And then it looks like there's a little doll skirt. And then we have dresses. Are you guys ready here for the doll dresses? Okay, so there's two. Oh my gosh, these are so cute. Four. <gasps> Stop it. Six. Eight. Oh my gosh, they're so stinking adorable. There's 10 and there's 12, 12 little doll dresses, plus the sets, plus the hangers, plus the little skirt. Oh my gosh, thank you so much, Karina. These are so stinking adorable. I so appreciate that you sent these all the way from Canada. Um, remember, we do have thank you prizes at the end of each month, um, but the uh, thank you prizes for the end of each month are for US only. But um, Debbie, the Canadian crotcheter, has offered to send a thank you gift for the end of the year. So anyone who donated from July to November will be entered into a drawing um, for Canada, for Canadians, um, for a box that she's going to send out. So thank you so much for sending these from Canada. I do appreciate it. Okay, next. So the next box comes from Natalie, and she is from a suburb not too far from me here in the Chicago area. And she sent a note, and she writes, Hi, Rose. Please find and close some hats, a couple of sets, and one scarf kerchief for wings. I had planned to make a couple of scarves, but ran out of time. I have never been fast at crocheting, and I'm just glad I was able to finish most of what I planned. I also want to thank you for all you do with coordinating everything for wings. It's a huge undertaking. There is no need to enter me in the drawing for thank you gifts. I just appreciate all of what you do in coordinating this huge drive for Wings and their recipients. There are tags on everything with yarn info, care instructions, and patterns, if I remembered. And I tried to mix up the colors, but I think blue was just the color of the month. Take care. I wish you carrots and zoo the best. Natalie. Okay, she also orders lots of stitch markers from me. So she sent back all of the little <laughs> the doodads for the stitch markers. You didn't have to do that, but thank you so much. Okay, so here is is a cowl and a hat set and it says it's Karen Simply Soft and the pattern is a variation of Bago Day Easy Crochet Scarf number 669 and she ran out of yarn. <laughs> so there is one set and then this one is hat and fingerless gloves and she says 100% acrylic hobby yarn, wash and dry, yes, hat pattern is Bago Day Fingerless Mitts by Fiber Flux. Ooh, that's so pretty and then this is the kerchief and it says uh, mandala baby machine wash and dry 100% acrylic so there's that scarf and then we've got um, this chunky hat pattern by fiber flux called the quick gift slouchy hat 
and that's Amigo Yarn. So there is the hat, that's cool. And then this one says, yarn is Hobby Amigo Acrylic, pattern is Bag O'Day, Easy Basic Beginner Beanie Child Size, okay? And then this one is the same thing. Oh my gosh, these are so pretty. This one says, this yarn is Karen Simply Soft, and the pattern is Bag O Day Unisex Beanie. And then this one says, the yarn is Karen Simply Soft, pattern is by Jonah Martinez, the Seashell Spiral uh, Divine Hat and Cowl. And then, oh my gosh, look at these little baby hats with the little ears. This says Newborn, um, All Machine Wash and Dry, Something is acrylic and something is polyester. So there's three of those little newborn hats. And then these two little baby hats here say zero to three months, Bernat bundle up, machine wash and dry. Wow, Zah, thank you so much, Natalie, for all the labels on everything and letting us know the yarn and the pattern. I do appreciate it. And it's fine that blue was the color of the month. I love it. So thank you so, so much. Okay, next. So the next box comes from Brenda and she's from California and she sent a note. Rose, all of the items in this box have a story behind them. They were named the quarantine hats. When we first went into lockdown, the facility I work at was not allowing the residents to leave their rooms. I provide care for one of their residents. When I told her she wasn't able to leave her room, she asked me if I brought my knitting with me. I told her no, that I only do that when I'm at home. She told me to start bringing my knitting and to get a start on my hats for family early. So I did. Every morning I would show her the yarn I brought and started working on it after she was settled for the morning. At lunch, she would want to see how much progress I made and again before I left for the day. She eventually started to call them the quarantine hats. I got tired of making hats, so I made other things as well, but the name stuck. I did tell her about wings and that I was donating everything I made during that time to them. Her response was, that's good because we live in California and we don't need all that winter stuff in this part. <laughs> Smiley face. That's the story behind the quarantine hats from Brenda. Brenda, that is so sweet. Thank you so much for sharing that story. Um, she's got hats, scarves, cowls, ear warmers, and there's two sets. So I'm going to start with the sets. They're so pretty. This is a cowl and a hat. And then here is another cowl and a hat. Oh my gosh, they're so pretty. And then let me show you ear warmers. Okay, there's a ton of ear warmers. There's two, four. Oh my goodness, they're so pretty. Six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, sixteen. And I think this could double for an ear warmer or a cowl. So there's all of those. And then let me show you the scarves. So these are either scarves or cowls. Oh my gosh, so many different varieties. There's two. Check this one out, you guys. Oh my, that is so pretty. I just love that. So there's three, four, five, <laughs> six. There's a nice scarf. Seven eight and nine. So nine scarves or cowls. And then we have a lot of hats too. So there's two, four, six, eight, 10, 12. Oh my goodness. 14. You are so busy. 16, 18, Holy smackerels, 20, 22, and 23 hats. So Brenda, thank you so much for all of this stuff. I'm so excited that you got your, um, the person that you were helping out, they were helping you out too. That's a pretty good story. I love the quarantine hats and all the other items that you sent. They're beautiful, so I do appreciate it. Okay, next. The next box came from Josephine and she's from Arizona. There was no note in the bag, but there was a lot of hats and stuff. So let me show you. This is a set, looks like a hat and a scarf, so pretty. And then there are two more scarves that I saw in there. Oh my gosh, I just love them. I need to make some scarves. Okay, and then we have hats. So there's two, four, 
six, I love these, eight, 10, 12, and 13. Oh my goodness, Josephine, thank you so much for all of these awesome, awesome donations. I really do appreciate it. I love it that uh, we are getting donations from around the country and around the world. It's pretty it's pretty exciting. Okay, we got a lot more to go. So the next box comes from Sue and she's from Missouri and she sent this adorable card. Oh my gosh, he's so cute. Rose, for all you do for, for wishes, hope you can use my offering and working on washcloths for October from Sue. Thank you, Sue, I appreciate it. Okay, so there were a couple of bags in there that said hat and scarf and she tied it pretty good. So I'm gonna leave it like that, but there's two bags like that that say hat and scarf. She did have everything else in bags too, just to protect them in shipping, but I did take those out of the bag. So are you guys ready? We have a bunch of cowls and scarves. There's two, there's four. Oh my gosh, so much beautiful stuff. There's six, look at that. Oh my gosh, eight and 10. So 10 scarves or cowls and then we have hats. There's two and four. Oh my gosh, Sue, thank you so much for sending all of these beautiful items. I really appreciate it. I love that you guys send them in sets and you send hats separate and scarves separate. And you know, everyone has a different preference for what they want to wear in the winter. So thank you so, so much, Sue. That was a great, great donation. Okay, next. The next box comes from Wendy and Wendy is from Arizona. And Wendy sent this card. So cute. And it says, Hi Rose, thank you so much for supporting domestic violence. This is a cause that, that is important to our family. My daughter and grandson are victims of domestic violence. Thankfully, your, our family helped her and my grandson get an um, out after many years of abuse. They are no longer victims, but are now victors. My mother, daughter, grandson, and I all worked on making these hats and scarves. We hope they bring warmth to whomever receives them. Thank you for taking uh, taking on and letting us share in such an important cause. The four generations, Wendy, Judy, Stephanie, and Samuel. And Samuel looks like signed his own name. So I apologize if I thought it was Wendy that sent the box, but it's all four of you that sent the box and I really really do appreciate it so there's a ton of hats you guys did an amazing job and there's one set and I'm gonna leave it in the bag so there is the hat and it looks like there's a scarf right there oh my gosh and it's a really pretty green and then we have a cowl that's gorgeous and we have a scarf also so pretty and then we have a ton of hats there's two four, six, ooh, that's velvet, <laughs> eight, 10, 12, look at the little one, 14, 16, and 18. So wow, 18 hats. Thanks so much to you guys. Your four generations are awesome. It's so exciting that you work together to make all of these hats. Um, I do appreciate it. And I'm sorry that your family had to go through that, but a lot of people do have to go through it. So thank you so, so much. Okay, next. So the next bag came from April and she's from Indiana. There was no note in the bag, which is fine. Um, she sent a couple of sets and then some other things. So let me show you. There are two ear warmers. Those are so pretty. And then she put these in a separate bag that said child hats. And it says um, plus one dot crochet. That's who the pattern is by. So if you wanted to look that up. And then there's another bag that says hat and cowl set. So there is that. That's so pretty. And it says the pattern is by plus one dot crochet on Etsy. It's called the fish scale set. So there you go. That is so pretty. And then we've got some other sets here with no notes in them, which is fine. So there's a hat and a cowl and another hat and a cowl. Oh my gosh, these are just beautiful. And then look at this pink one. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, for sure. 
<laughs> so April, thank you so much for sending the beautiful sets and the kids hats and the ear warmers and the other set. They're all absolutely beautiful. And I'm really appreciative of all of you guys who spend your own time making these, your own money to ship them and um, just your thoughts that go into it when you make them. I do appreciate it. Okay, next. Okay, the next bag comes from Naomi and she's from Kansas City. Hi, Naomi. She writes, Aloha Rose, I can only give information of yarn for four of the ear warmers. Um, okay, let me find the ear warmers. The two hot pink are Red Heart with Love. The solid gray and the gray with blue is made with Lion Brand jeans. I think it's this one. And the blue is Lion Brand Summer Nights. All the other items I made a while ago for a craft fair, but didn't find a home. So I hope they will now. Everything can be washed and dried. Thank you, Rose, for all you do. So here, let me show you the other ear warmers. Oh, those are so pretty. Um, here is some, here are some fingerless gloves. Oh my gosh, look at the little buttons on those. Those are so pretty. Here are some more fingerless gloves. This has the button on it. Oh my gosh, they're gorgeous. These are bun or ponytail hats. So they have the little hole in the top. So there's three of those. And then she's got some character hats. Are you guys ready? Okay, uh, if you guys saw like, um, not part one, but the end of August, we had someone donate two minion sets and they were just so cute. So here is a minion hat. Here is a Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtle hat, and it looks like this is, what is this, a Minecraft thing? I don't know. Oh my gosh. They are so pretty. And then she just has the list of what she donated on there. So Naomi, thank you so much for sending all of these awesome, awesome items. They are all absolutely gorgeous. I love them. Okay, next. So the next box comes from Lynette, and she is from Michigan, and she wrote a note. Hello, Rose. So happy to donate to Wings. You are just fabulous, and so are many so are all the many contributors love to watch from Lynette. Okay, so Lynette, you are super, super talented. I'm just saying that right now. Here are two scarves. Oh my gosh, I love these. They are so pretty. Okay, here are more scarves. Oh my gosh, like these are thick and so beautiful. Oh my goodness. I would ask you for the patterns, but they're all knitted. So I would have no idea how to even replicate them anyway, but they're beautiful. So there's four scarves and then we have two cowls. Oh my gosh. That one is sparkly, you guys. <laughs> and then we have hats. There's two and four. Oh my goodness. Thank you so, so much for donating all of these beautiful items. Now I did want to bring something up. Someone did ask where they could send the items to. Um, I've gotten emails and comments. So the address where you can send them to is listed down in the description box below. It is to my post office box. And then speaking of the post office box, you guys, I am a single mom and I work full time. I only go to the post office twice a week. So if you don't see your package here, I'm pretty sure it's coming. Um, um, I get lots and lots of emails. Did you get my box? Did you get my box? Um, like I said, I had 40 boxes this time. So when you send me an email, I have to try and dig through 40 boxes to see if your box is there. So please just have some patience um, when you're sending in donations to Wings. Uh, usually if you have a tracking number and it tracks and says that it arrived, then it's at the post office box. Um, but I can't make a video every day. So there is gonna be a little bit of a delay from when it gets to my post office box to when I show it on a video. So I do appreciate your patience with that. Okay, let's get to the next box. So the next box comes from Kathy and she's from Arizona and she sent this beautiful butterfly card and it says, hi Rose, I lost count, but enclosed are two hats and many scarves, <laughs> love Kathy. It's okay, you guys don't have to count, it's awesome. We're gonna count on screen, okay? All right, so there are the two hats and they are so, so pretty. And the rest of these are scarves. Are you guys ready? You can help me count. All right, there's two. Oh, that's really thick too. All right, there's four. Oh, that's okay. So I'm, I'm gonna have a comment on all of them because they're so pretty. <laughs> there's six, that's sparkly yarn. <laughs> there is eight, ooh, purple. Oh my gosh, see, I'm gonna have a comment on all of them. There's 10. There is, whoops, 12. There is 14. 
Holy smokes, you were busy, huh? There's 16. Okay, so we need to know the pattern for that because it's so pretty. Um, okay, so there's 18 and then we have 19. So thank you so, so much for all of these gorgeous scarves. That way people can pick out a scarf if there was a hat there that they liked and there was no scarf attached to it. So I do appreciate it. You are amazing. You are like a scarf queen. <laughs> thank you so, so much. Okay, next. So the next box comes from Joanne and she is also from a suburb not too far from me here in the Chicago area and she sent a note and it says hi Rose I made a ton of hats and scarves for wings go bears yay thank you for all you do Joanne oh my gosh Joanne you're a rock star okay that's all I'm saying all right I'm gonna go through the sets first she's got like five or six sets here so here's one these are just so pretty this is an ear warmer and a scarf you guys, this is that um, flex yarn from Michaels. Oh, I love it. Hat and a scarf. Here's another one and it's purple. Okay, and then here is the last set. Oh my gosh, these are so pretty. Okay, and then we have scarves. There's two. Oh, she put a tag on this one. This is Delish Boutique from Yarn Bee. Um, and it's called, I don't know what it's called. This has alpaca in it, so I'm gonna leave this with the scarf. So anyway, there's two, and then here is four. Oh my goodness, that's thick. And then here is, oh, I love this one too. I love them all. There's six, there is eight, and there is nine. Nine scarves plus all those sets. So Joanne, thank you so, so much for sending that in. I do appreciate it. I know you know how cold it gets here because you don't live that far from me. So <laughs> I do appreciate it and I hope to meet you one day. Okay, next. So the next box comes from Annie and she's from Maryland. Hi, Ann. And she writes, oh, sorry, there's the card. It's awesome. I love it. Hi, Rose. I got a bit carried away. I had fun and hopefully it will keep some folks warm. Please do not feel like you have to show everything. I appreciate you and I love your stitch markers from Anne. And she is also known as Goddess18. So I don't know if that's on Instagram, but you can go check her out. And she is from Maryland. Okay, so she sent like a little bit of everything. There's mittens and scarves and hats and sets. So we're going to start with the scarves because they're beautiful. Oh my gosh there's two there's four look at the pom-poms oh yeah baby you know it and then we have some mittens these are awesome oh my gosh I love those there's two pairs of mittens and then there is an ear warmer and we have a ton of hats so there's two four six that's cool <laughs> eight Oh, look at the purple. 10 <laughs> and 12. And then we have some sets. Okay, so she has these in bags, but in this one bag, she's got two in one. So I'm going to show you. There's one set. Oh, these are so pretty. There's another set. And then here she writes medium hat and cowl. So there is the hat. And there is the cowl. And then we have small hat and cowl and she writes made with love. So there is the hat, there's the cowl, oh my goodness. And then we have medium hat and scarf made with love. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna leave those in there. There you go. And then we have another one that says large hat and cowl. So there's that one. Oh, these are so pretty. I wish I had time to take everything out of the bags, but I don't. Medium hat and mittens. That's pretty. That is sparkly yarn. Oh my gosh. And thank you so much for sending all of these beautiful items. I do appreciate it. I know you're Maryland, so you probably get just as cold as we do, but I do appreciate you supporting Wings and helping us out. Okay, next. So the next box comes from Dixie and she's from Texas. Hi, Dixie. There was no note in the box, but that's okay. We have hats, sets, scarves, cowls, whole bunch of stuff so here is the first one this is a set so it is a hat 
and a scarf. And then I found some, uh, an ear warmer. So there is an ear warmer. And then I found some scarves in the box. Ooh, so pretty, I love that. Here is um, another scarf and a cowl. <clears throat> and then we have this big cowl right here, so pretty. Then we have hats, you guys. Maybe two, they're awesome. Four, six, eight, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, and 20, so 20 hats, and the rest of everything else is in bags. Let me show you. Okay, so they're not labeled, but I can tell this is an ear warmer, and that is a scarf, and then we have a hat and a scarf. Gosh, these are just so pretty. Here is a hat and a scarf or a cowl, and then we have, oh, look at that waffle stitch, hat, and a scarf and then it looks like there is a hat and a scarf oh my gosh these are so pretty okay hat I love the puff stitch or bean stitch whatever you want to call that it's so pretty okay and then we have a hat and a scarf oh these are awesome and there's a hat and a scarf Holy smackerels, you guys are absolutely amazing. Thank you so, so much, Dixie, for sending in all of these sets and the hats and the scarves and everything. It's just all absolutely beautiful. I do appreciate it. Okay, I think we have like three more boxes. So the next box comes from Sandy and she actually doesn't live that far from me. I met her once in person. And hi, Sandy, there was no note in the bat or in the box. She did send me some yarn. Oh my gosh, what is this? Uh, Multi-casual boucle by Sensations. Isn't that pretty? Thank you so much, Sandra. But let me, let's get to the good stuff. Let's get to the hats and stuff. Okay, so there are two. Oh my gosh, I love that rainbow hat. Four, six, eight, 10, 12, 14 and 16 so there's 16 hats and then we have some sets in the bag so this has a hat and a keyhole scarf so you can see the hat there and there is the scarf oh my gosh these are so pretty hat and a cowl so there's the hat and there's the cowl Sandra these are beautiful hat and cowl on this one so there's the hat and the cowl and this one says hat and scarf Ooh, so pretty I love the design there's the hat and there's the scarf so Sandra thank you so so much for sending all the sets and all the hats and the yarn you didn't have to do that I do appreciate it and I did lie to you before there are actually there were four more boxes so we have three more to go now so the next box comes from my girl Rochelle. She is also here on YouTube. Her channel name is called EJ's Daughter. You guys have to go check her out. She's super, super talented. Um, and she left me a little note. It says, hi, Rose, no long note. Just thank you from Rochelle. <laughs> oh my gosh, Rochelle, I love you. Okay, so there are some hats and she tried to do some bears colors. Check that out, go bears. So there's three hats and then the rest of these like are scarves and or cowls. So here are two. Look at that for Christmas. So pretty. Here is, oh, that's a pretty cowl. Three. Oh, this one's even prettier because it's sparkly. Four. And then look at the fleece one. Five. Oh, fun fur. Shut the front door. That is so cool. Oh my goodness. I lost count. There, I don't know, six, seven. There's another fleece cowl. And here is, oh, look at the knitted one. And then here are the last two. Oh my gosh, Rochelle, you've been so busy. Thank you so much for sending all of these warm winter items. I mean, I mean, you're in Colorado, so you know how cold it can get. So I do appreciate you sending in these donations and everyone go check her out. She'll be linked down below. Okay, next. All right, you guys, the next box came from my good friend, Tracy Rosetti, and she is actually here on YouTube as well. Go check her out. She is uh, 
crochet Rosetti, and she is so talented. She crochets, she knits, she does art stuff. She makes these cute little elves. Oh my gosh, she is just amazing. So crochet Rosetti, I'm gonna have her link down below in the description box. She sent a humongous box and this card. You're so sweet, Tracy. She says, thank you for all you do. There's two pocket shawls or scarves, and then she put brain fart. <laughs> It's okay. And one neck warmer and some yarn for a giveaway or for you to keep from Tracy. Oh, you're so sweet, Tracy. So she sent, I'll get these out of the way. She sent four of these Ferris wheels. And I actually like this yarn. So I don't know. I'll have to think about whether or not it's purple. It's purple, guys. Do I give it away? Leave a comment. Should I give this away? <laughs> Let me know. Okay, so then we have a cowl here. Oh my gosh, I love this happy yarn. There's a cowl, and then, oh my gosh, this is humongous, you guys. This is a pocket shawl or scarf, however you want to think about it. Look at this. It is monstrous. Like, it is super huge, you guys. Oh my God, I just love it. I love this, Tracy. Oh my gosh, I just absolutely adore it. Okay, here is the ear warmer gorgeous and then it looks like here is the other pocket shawl or pocket shawl pocket scarf oh my gosh hold on guys okay can you go oh my gosh it has a hood it has a hood this is the hood it's hard to show it to you if you guys probably want to see it you could probably go to her channel and she'll show it to you better but you could see the two pockets and then there's a hood on it OMG. Yes, ma'am. Thank you so much. I do appreciate you sending this over for wings and the other one. These are absolutely incredible. I want you guys to go and check out Tracy. Okay. She's linked down below. Okay. We have one more box. All right, you guys, the last box comes from one of my favorite people in the whole wide world. You guys are all my favorite people, but <laughs> I just love this lady. Her name is Billy, and she also goes by the Crafty Floridian. She's here on YouTube. She does some great charity work herself. Um, that was the other thing I wanted to mention is that you guys, if you have something that you would like to donate and it's not on the list for wings, please go check out Billy the Crafty Floridian because she is taking some specific donations for a um, reservation and then you can also check out Lisa from Happy to Hook Creations who also takes donations so make sure you go check them out send them an email if you have any questions but this is from Billy the Crafty Floridian oh my god I want to meet her one day okay so here is her card and you guys can go check out her YouTube channel to get more information oh my gosh Billy I just love you and there is a little thank you Oh, okay. She sent a ton of stuff. Oh my gosh. Billy, you're a maniac. I'm just saying. Okay. So there's two sets here. Oh my God. So it matches right there. That is so cute. Billy, where do you find time to do all this? By the way, Billy makes bags and they're amazing. And she makes damn it dolls and they're amazing too. I'm sorry if I said a bad word. <laughs> so there is a second set. And then we have some ear warmers. So there's two and three and then we have some scarves there's two and there's a cowl there's four and look at this beautiful scarf you guys it's a granny scarf it's all greens with a little blue oh my gosh that is awesome billy i just love it you know i'm gonna find my damn it doll i'm gonna show you guys what a damn it doll is Okay, so Billy um, now actually sews the Dammit dolls, but back in the day, <laughs> she actually crocheted her Dammit dolls, and she sent me this one specifically because my favorite color is purple. Look, even the hair is purple. Oh my gosh. Okay, so if you guys don't know about Dammit dolls, I'm going to read you the little card on here. It says... Uh, damn it doll, whatever things don't go so well and you want to hit the wall and yell, here's a little damn it doll. <clears throat> Just grab it firmly by the legs and find a place to slam it. And as you whack the stuffing out, yell damn it, damn it, damn it. <laughs> so this was the damn it doll that Billy made for me. And I have not whacked it because it's too beautiful. But now she makes them sewn. So go check out Billy the Crafty Floridian. Okay, let's finish with her hats because she sent a ton of hats, you guys. All right, there's two, <laughs> four. Oh my gosh, Billy, six. You are amazing. Eight, 
10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, 24, oh my, 26, 28, 30, 32, and 34. So there's 34 hats plus all that other stuff from Billy. And I think maybe we will end out <laughs> this video with our little doll here because she's so cute and I appreciate Billy making her. So anyone that I did mention that has a YouTube channel, I will link them down in the description box below. I appreciate everyone who sends in donations every month or once ever or never. Um, again, I encourage you to donate locally. And I hope you guys have a great rest of your day whenever you're watching this. And don't forget to leave a comment down below. Talk to you later. Bye.